And that's where our identical twins come in, because with them, the whole package is the same. What happens to one should happen to the other. So what do you expect to happen tonight? In the back of your head, you know, you're thinking, yeah, this is, you know, if this stuff really works, then, in, you know. Right, I'm wearing the secret formula. Exactly. You know? Like, nobody else has this. Right. You know? For our experiment, we gave all the twins a scent, but only one twin in each set got the scent with Dr. Cutler's pheromones mixed in, and we didn't tell them who had this secret weapon. The gentlemen, when I ring this bell every five minutes, you're going to rotate one table up. So you Sarah. David. Mom, and I'm Bridget. Ten different dates, each one lasting just five minutes. Would the pheromones make a difference? Tell me a little about yourself, Aaron. Gentlemen up one, please. That's in nineteen seventy-four. Nice meeting you. I was born in Queens. Well, it was good to meet you. This is your final date. At the end of the night, we tallied the results. Of the ten dates, nine men wanted to see Sarah again, but Bridget attracted just five. As for the male twins, Dave got ten women interested in him. Paul had only six. So, who was wearing the pheromones? Sarah and Dave, the two who scored better. 